All right, so I'm here on the Scratch Team X account. This is their post that they made on July 24th. It says here, I'll read it to you. Panelists at AI Ethics and Creative Learning. Possibilities and pitfalls are exploring how to iterate, challenge, and engage AI tools in playful and creative ways while digging into the shortcomings of the emerging technology. There's so much to learn at hashtag scratch conference. And there's another screenshot here with more words. I noticed when you do a black woman, it automatically does a dark skinned woman. I thought it was pretty, but it was trying to figure out how to do an erasure woman. When I tried to do light skin, it made the hair straight and showed me white features, but right skin tone, but couldn't find the balance. I put the same description of a character several times, and it was really cool. I thought it was interesting how it made a superhero in all these different career fields. Now I have a doctor, a knight in shining armor, and a chef. So this seems pretty good at first, right? Because you can like make inclusive pictures and clip art with this AI. But I'm ultimately against it, because you can see here, this is my comment, this is a bad idea. Instead of having children find their own artwork or even draw and improve their skills, you're encouraging them to make mindless pictures from prompts made from an artist who doesn't think nor care. AI will forever be subpar, and I don't want that on Scratch. So Scratch has a lot of things on it right now that are mindless, like remixing has become copying. It's all just a fight to have the most views, the most hearts, the most stars. But now it's going to be the same thing but with ai art all over it i hate ai art and i think it's horrible how you can instantly notice that it's ai just by looking at it by seeing like would the artist have chosen to draw it this way no because it's not drawn by a real artist this is drawn by a computer who doesn't even know what it's trying to draw or what a woman or a black person actually is so i feel like now instead of having people make their own artwork or find actually good artwork online that was made by someone else and are instead encouraging people to use ai to make bad looking artwork that will clog the site up with a bunch of ai art that looks bad some people's art looks bad i mean that'll be on scratch forever you can't fix that but you can fix not having ai on the site because now like people are gonna be finding AI art in Scratch really easily, but before, they would have to get AI art from somewhere else and find that extra step, and that's why there wasn't very much AI on Scratch. Like, encouraging someone to make an AI with Scratch? That's good! People have done that! But building AI into Scratch for image generation, like making clip art like this, that's not good. It's just gonna make the site worse, and it's going to encourage people to spend less time being creative and spend more time not being creative. Instead of making artwork, they're going to be getting artwork. AI can be used really well. You can use it for moderation or to even recommend projects. If Scratch could recommend people your projects who would like them, then that would be really, really good. But instead, they're using it to make all projects worse, basically. Because before, you could either have them not have AI, which is good, or have AI, which is bad. But having AI was more difficult. Now it's going to be more easy, and everything is just going to be worse. AI will never be better than any legitimate artwork that you can make or find. This is a second screenshot here that doesn't have any text, but it's showcasing how this person's making a game with AI art and the costumes. And that brought to my attention another thing that's really crucial. These costumes are AI art, but AI will never be able to animate them. So now all the projects will have slideshows, no animation, everything will just look bad, and it will have all these details that don't make any sense. And around it here are more pictures of AI art. I don't know if these were generated exactly by Scratch's AI, but you can tell here that they're just so obviously made by AI. Like if you look at the butterflies here, they don't use the right proportions, and they don't fly realistically, and the cat has eyes that stare into your soul <laughs> and think of everything bad that you've seen on AI art anywhere now it's gonna be on scratch like there's a community of actual artists on scratch who make art they don't code they don't animate they don't do anything else they don't make music their goal on scratch is to be noticed because of their artwork and now this is going to kind of take over their place if it makes artwork that's any good they're just going to get replaced. And if it makes artwork that's bad, then the website will be bad. There's no good answer here, and everything is a bad ending. There is no good that can come out of this, and AI will always just be mediocre.